Hi everyone. Um, so I have fluff nest plushies here. And didn't I always say that my role was no plushies? Well, you know, I've kind of been collecting these fluff nests for a while. And I have another box to open from them. I've actually had it for quite a while and I don't exactly remember which fluff it is. So I'm going to open it up and we're going to see. So sorry, the box is kind of locking everything at the moment. But I will just undo the tape real quick and open it up. So, inside, it actually looks like there might be two fluffs in there. Oh, look at that. <laughs> there is two fluffs in here, you guys. Okay, so firstly, some nice little tissue and a thank you packet cute little sticker on it. Usually in the thank you envelope, there is kind of a, like a packet that you can make a bunch of hats with. Let's see if I can get this open without ripping it too much. There we go. So it says, welcome to the family. There's a cute little card and it opens up just so. And inside, it actually has information on how to wash your Puff Pals, which is nice. A certificate of adoption, that's new. On the back, you can kind of fill in your information there. And also a cute little sticker. Um, take to the side, inside of the box. I think I ordered this. I don't remember, maybe it came with, um, Sorry, I'm trying to decide what to do with this tape. Maybe it came with my order, because this was part of an order that I placed during their um, campaign to raise funds for their um, video game, and I am part of that. And I could be an alpha tester, but I don't have the systems, I don't think, to test it on, and I haven't really been keeping up on it. I do have like about mm, 70 emails from them with updates about their fundraiser, um, which I can't even think, I think it's on GoFundMe. Um, so I should keep up with it. But anyway, right now we're worried about the fluffs. So in here, check it out, you guys. <laughs> I have a fourth box. So this one is Kichi. This one is Suki. This one is Howl. And then this one here, the new one, is Alice. So I feel like Alice is a counterpart to um, Stuki because they have similar blue markings, but one's white and one's black. And I feel like Howl and um, Kitchy are similar because they also have the similar markings, and one's red and one's white. So there is, see if I can squeeze these all over here. Oh my gosh, you guys, just look at this. Just look how soft and squishy they are. Okay. So, I have had these for quite a while. I can't even, I think this one was my first one. I really wish that I had the original Fox, the orange one, that is like this. Oh, I will note, so these three, these three that I had, I'll have three tails, and Alice here only has one, one big fat fluffy one. She technically says Alice the fox, and I feel like she could be, I don't know, but the other three have three tails, so what's this last thing in here? Look at this, you guys. Oh my gosh. It's a dragon, like this one over here. So this dragon is Zilying the dragon, and this one is... Tin, tin Tin, the dragon, but I just love it. Look at the constellation on them. Oh, he's so beautiful. So gorgeous. Has the markings on both sides. So I will say the one thing about these dragons, they don't really balance very well on their own, as you can see, um, but they certainly make for great snugglers. Oh my gosh, they're so soft. I have, let's see here now, one, two, three, four, five, six plushes. 
Um, I love them. I really love Huff Cows. They do some amazing work. Just check in the box to see if there's anything else. So that is it. I got this new fox and this new dragon. And I hope <laughs> that is enough for my collection. So thank you guys for watching. Um, let me know what you think of Puff Cows. Do you have any yourself? Um, I think this has to be my limit because they're running out of room for me. But thank you. Have a great day, everybody. Bye.